friends, this time I'm reading Harold the Iceberg Melts Down. Written by Lisa Wislick. Illustrated by Rebecca Syracuse. To listen to more stories like this, please subscribe to this channel. Thank you! Harold the Iceberg Melts Down. Harold was a head of lettuce. A head of iceberg lettuce, to be exact. Harold often spent his days worrying. He worried about small things. What is that? He worried about big things. What is that? In fact, Harold tended to worry about everything. Harold liked to watch documentaries to help manage his worries. Learning helped him understand things, and understanding helped him feel like he didn't need to worry. But then he watched one that didn't help ease his worries. Instead, it left him very concerned. Be very, very concerned. Friends, I am very concerned. I watched a documentary about icebergs. I am an iceberg, see? It was very educational. I learned that I am very old and wise, mostly a below the surface kind of bird. And I'm super majestic and beautiful. I could probably win a contest, though they didn't really talk about how I ended up in a fridge. At first, the other food in the fridge didn't mind Harold's rambling. Sometimes he needed to talk his worries out, and his friends were there to listen. But then things started to get a little out of hand. But the most important thing I learned, did you know that the icebergs are melting? At an alarming rate? Um, Harold? The icebergs in the documentary were very large, and I am very small. That means I'm melting much faster than they are. That's why I'm small. It's already started. What do I do? I need to stop melting. The freezer. That will slow it down. Unfortunately, the way was blocked. Okay, plan B. I'll go to the very back of the fridge. Maybe it's colder there. It was a little colder, but it was also dark and lonely. And a little bit sticky. Maybe I just need a disguise. Then the warmth won't be able to find me. Hey, Harold, why don't you drink some water? What am I going to do? Are all icebergs just doomed to melt away? Why didn't the documentary tell me how to survive longer? His friends kept trying to help. Let's count to ten together, Harold. One, two, three, four. But Harold was so focused on his impending doom that they couldn't get through to him. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. It's starting. This is the end. Harold? Yes? Would you like to try blowing some bubbles with us? Harold? Hmm? You're a head of iceberg lettuce. Lettuce doesn't melt. But... Oh! That's good news, right? You're not melting. 
Harold was quiet for a moment. But there are real icebergs melting still? Oh well. Yes. My cousins! What are we doing to help them? No one had an answer for Harold. It was such a big problem, and they were so little. How could they make a difference? Although Harold was still worried, he took a deep breath, counted to ten, and thought up a plan. Save the planet, keep it cool, no planet B. Save our birds. Ideas, recycle, speak up, reusable bags, less meat. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked this video. Please share with your friends what you learned today. For more videos, please subscribe. Thank you.